and it's time for the main event of the evening. Happy UFC Saturday, beer drinkers. Welcome to Brews with Beck. I'm Dan, and how the hell is your family? Uh, let's get to it. Hopefully you're well. I uh, got a lovely beer that I got from Handy Mark in Burbank. Go to Handy Mark in Burbank if you want good beer and you're in L.A. Say what up to Mark for me. Uh, this one is uh, very nicely rated. A collaboration between two uh, two just you know legendary East Coast breweries, uh, Equilibrium uh, out of Middletown, New York, and Pariah uh, Brewing out of Broussard, Louisiana. Uh, Pariah known I know them for Ghost in the Machine uh, and uh, Equilibrium for many of theirs. This this beer right here is a literally kind of a mashup of a beer that uh, Equilibrium did that's called Straight Out of the Laboratory, which is a triple that uh, rates quite well and obviously Ghost in the Machine. So anyway, let's get to it. Ghost in the Laboratory by Equ Equilibrium Brew Brewery collaboration with Pariah. 8.5 on the Richter. Tap that in. It's ready to fight. Um, so anyway, it says you... Using a mashed up grain bill uh, from straight out of the laboratory and ghost in the machine, we used a massive dose of CO2 extract, citra incognito, and our hand-selected citra T90 on the hot, hot side, followed by an insane amount of citra lupo max, and our hand-selected citra T90s for the double dry hop. Sounds pretty scientific. Uh, that's why it's called a laboratory. The heaviest dry hop in Equilibrium's history, ghost in the laboratory pours opaque and vivid yellow, and has very strong aromas of extreme mango supported by tropical nectar. The flavor is explosive with extremely saturated notes of mango smoothie, grove stand orange juice with plenty of pulp, orange tang, tropical fruit cup and syrup, dank grass, and a rainbow melon cream skull note from our uh, hashtag EQ juice finish. That's I'm I'm glad I could say that all and I'm 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 a good reader on that one. I'm I'm gonna comp, you know pat myself on the back and self high five for getting through that one. Uh but yeah, very stoked about all that. Uh, as you can see, as you said, you know, um uh, what did it say? Uh opaque and vivid yellow. So there you go. I just think it looks somewhere between orange juice and pine chalky pineapple juice, but as as a lot of these do. Um it's, I think it's about three weeks in the can, so Still pretty dang fr 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 fresh. And uh, that's about it. So leave in the comments if you've had this or if you've had other stuff you've had by Equilibrium or Pariah. Uh, you know, love love to hear comments. What you're doing on this Saturday. Got another UFC tonight. Dodgers are playing the Padres. The UFC includes uh, Corey Sanhagen versus Rob Font. Uh, Jessica and I butcher the names on and Andrade versus uh, Tatiana Suarez and then a light heavyweight matchup Dustin Jacoby versus Kennedy I can't even say it in in Zexua I, I can't I am not even gonna try that Kennedy N. let's just go with that he's got a last name I should have should study uh, but that's going on tonight uh, you know the Wyndham uh, championship as far as golf is going on I'm, I'm doing all that I'm also uh, you know Always celebrating Nuggets basketball championship uh, this year, so booyah. But uh, ho hopefully you're well. Leave me in the comments any well wishes, anything you'd like. Let's get to it. Uh, already poured. Looks looks delicious. Let's get a smell. Already smells kind of like a little sweet and bready. Creamy, sweet, and bready. Maybe a little brown sugar and like subtle orange okay well i'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna swirl it around later but let's get to it so hold your hold your glasses up get your cold beers ready so you can cheers me no words just emotions cheers to you and saturday the weekend let's roll delicious uh definitely some peppery orange julius and on that note please help me out and give me a quick like real it's free to you takes you a second give me a quick like right now super important to me really helps my channel and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe por favor amigos y amigas and let's let's get this party started you're already drinking with me you may as well subscribe and you know keep joining the train 
Um, so thank you very much. All right, let's let's continue. So far, so good. I'm gonna actually pour the rest in. That way, anything at the bottom is in there. Any of the uh, sediment. Let's see if there's any. Uh, not really. Yeah, not not too too much sediment or anything in that. But um, mouth feel. Let's see. Definitely get a little grapefruit and pineapple right there. Uh, Um, I'm going to say 40 out of a hundred. Got a very nice peppery Christmas to it. Not Christmas, crispness. Boom. Boom. Um, does it feel like eight and a half or does it feel less or more? Again, love to hear your notes if you've actually had this beer. Uh, no, let, let me know what you think. You could be drinking it right now with me. There you go. Um, it does. <clears throat> I definitely would know it's a double. Very peppery at the end, or, you know... <coughs> Has some, still has some hot burn, some, some pepper. Um, I kind of would have, <coughs> geez, kind of would have thought it was about, could have even said nine, but uh, bigger than eight. So I would have maybe guessed eight, six, eight, five. So taste about what it is, uh, at least to me. I'm, I'm just being honest. Never false on here. All right. So right now, everything you've heard, <clears throat> definitely getting that end pepper right now. I'm going to see what other people are saying about this. Again, leave your comments if you've had this. Uh, I'm going to give my final uh, you know, end result out and a grade and then get the hell out of here and prepare for UFC Saturday and you know all the other stuff. So one second. All right. Um, oh, excuse me. Na uh, neighbor, you know who you are. Uh, after I, now that I'm about getting done with all this pepperness of the beer, can you go to the store and get me a Colt 45? All oh, right, give me a Colt 45. Sweet. Uh, you know, works every time. I wish I had Colt 45 around here, but uh, when when I do find it, I will review it. I, I don't know. Leave in the comments if you know where I can get a Colt 45 because I haven't had one. That's that was literally the first beer I ever drank, and honestly, I haven't. I don't know the last time I drank one, but if I can get my hands on one, I'd want, love to review it. Uh, just for the aspect of it. Um, anyway, let's get back to this one. Um, uh, <laughs> saw like comments like danky and filling and it's back actually better out of the can than it is on tap. Uh, you know, they were sorry to say, um, guy said, you know, pretty one other comment, tangerines and navel oranges, zesty, pulpy, hazy, aromatic, uh, Apparently all citra with cryo variants, uh, brewmaster notes for details, tiki cocktail density re reached with 8.5%, uh, percent, uh, rapid downhill deluge to finish, and he said he's sipping groovy, and he gave it a 4 or 5 out of 5. Just a heads up, out of 7,500 people, they give it right now about a f just about a 4 4 out of 5. That's that's pretty good. So when I saw this, and so I think I literally got this for like 6 bucks a can at uh, Handy Market, so it seems like a pretty good deal to me. Um, but anyway, I just get a lot, a lot of green pepper at the end with some, uh, a little bit of creaminess, some grapefruit, some pineapple, uh, maybe a twinge of melon, little, little dank, you know, some dry hop breadiness, but, but I like it because there's just a subtle sweetness, but there's not, it's not that. Big, you know, that caramel toffee sweetness. They don't, I don't mind. I just prefer in my, you know, uh, New England IPAs. I'm, I kind of, I don't really love the caramel toffee sweetness. I like that to not, not be there. That's just my preference. You can tell me what your preference is. But anyway, you know what? I'm going to slam this, give it a grade because I just want it all just, you know, right there when I'm giving it a grade. So put up, put up your glasses. Let's drink the rest. Cheers.
put it down like a man. It's over. Uh, all right. Definitely got some end pepper, some, uh, yeah, every, everything I've said in this video, that's about all I can say. Cause I, maybe, maybe it's like some weediness. Um, cause I'm sure there's, there is weed in this obviously. So very nice, uh, from Stowe down to Hell No. Um, not quite tippity top, but it's, for me, it is absolutely the tippity top of solid. I'd give it a very solid 96. Um, like rock solid A, uh, A beer. Not completely blown away by it, but it's it's nice for sure. Uh, I would take another one of these any day. Um, but yeah, rock solid A. Leave in the comments what any you know if you what what you graded anything you've had. Uh, hopefully you're having a smashing good time on your Saturday. Please give me a like and subscribe. Once again, give me a like and subscribe. Much appreciated. Enjoy your Saturday afternoon and evening. Keep your beverages cold and your your weather reasonably hot. And we'll see you out there. Enjoy the sports. See ya.